Hi everyone. Let us discuss this theorem, De Morvis theorem. So maybe this theorem you have already seen before it, but see this theorem is so much important for us. So let us discuss the statement of theorem as well as its proof. See this theorem says if you have cos theta plus i sin theta and there is bracket as to n, definitely we can write cos n theta plus i sin n theta, and it is true for every rational number n. Okay. So let us discuss its proof first. After that, we will discuss its applications. So yeah, we will start with left hand side, and we will try to bring right hand side. Okay, so let us consider cos theta plus i sin theta raised to n. So this is equal to. So you know that cos theta plus i sin theta can be replaced by can be written as e raised to i theta. So therefore, we can write e raised to i theta whole raised to n. So this is nothing but e raised to i n theta. So e raised to i theta means cos theta plus i sin theta. So therefore e raised to i n theta will be cos n theta plus i sin n theta. So in this way we proved this thing. Okay. So let us discuss its applications. Applications that means how can we use this theorem? Suppose we have cos theta plus i sin theta raised to five. Then using this De Morvis theorem, we can write definitely cos phi theta plus i sin phi theta, right? So if you have any rational number, this is the first example. Second example, cos theta plus i sin theta raised to two by three. Will you tell me what I supposed to write using De Morvis theorem? Yes, we can write here cos two theta by three plus i sin. 2 theta by 3 what it means whatever the power you have power of that bracket you can write as a multiple of theta here the power we have 2 by 3 so we can write cos 2 theta by 3 that means we are multiplying theta by 2 by 3 okay let me add one thing suppose we we have a minus sign here suppose cos theta minus i sin theta and suppose we have some power n So in this case also we can use De Morvis theorem if there is minus sign between that real and imaginary part. So we can write here cos n theta minus i n sine theta. Okay. So make a screenshot of it. Then we will stop. Thank you. Bye bye.